Welcome everyone to Genus with Just Commentary. So we're gonna check out a video entitled Adventure in Bali, amazing food and travel attraction in UBUD Bali, Indonesia. Of course, thank you very much for requesting this video. Don't forget guys, subscribe to Genus with Just Commentary, like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter. If you want me to react to a video, definitely leave a comment below and I'll try my best to react to it. Thank you very much, let's go ahead. Okay, so this is Bali, Indonesia. You don't need any seasonings. Of course with Mark Wynn. Oh, nice food all over the world. U B U D. Good morning. U B U D. Okay, sorry. McQueen's. Bali. Bali. And today we're gonna go do some oh, it's Ubud. Oh, I said U B U D. Okay. Very excited to go Indonesia. Wow. So tropical looking in Indonesia. And a little bit of sightseeing today. We're gonna get a taxi for the whole day and go to some restaurants and then he's gonna wait for us and we're just gonna, we hired him for the whole day. <laughs> All right. Thank you. What's your name? 36. Five hundred thousand. What? We're on our way to the first warroom. Five hundred thousand. What? Place that I am very excited to try. I guess if 36 means 36 US, that is a currency. Wow! We just made it to Sangye, but we wow. made it to the first. It's very interesting to see. I, <laughs> I, I want to see how much it will cost for normal food. Yes. Here's the restaurant right here. Wow. That's a very dumb to a restaurant. <laughs> Quiet! It's very quiet there. Wow. Ooh. It's chopping up just a mound of what appears to be cow skin. And there's also some tripe there. And then they're cooking uh, traditional Balinese cooking style over fire in the kitchen there. And then they're just assembling wow. all of the different dishes. So it's looks looking like corn leaf. <laughs> and that's a dish. No, I'll stop It's one of the most common of all Balinese dishes. It's usually like a, it's not really a salad, but it's a mixture. Of beef? And so this one is made with beef. Beef. And you can see all of those ingredients that are in there. There's a lot of like organic At least it does not look like you can really fool your stomach. Beans, some lemongrass in there and then serve with rice, rice and soup. And they do give you a rice spoon and, soup. and fork. But most people eating here are all eating with their fingers and then just using the spoon for the soup. Ah, so okay. gonna, I got to reach in with my fingers <laughs> and grab a little bit. Look at that mix. That's just beautiful. A hand mix. That's really just a classic. And you have to mix dish. it with the rice. Mix in with the rice. Wow. <laughs> that, that, that feels like this is what they're uh, looking like. I'm um, cut fish. Like meat floss. Guy cut fish. Hmm. I must admit that is a very quiet environment. Very quiet. By the way, I have the headphones in my ears, so very quiet. The lemongrass in there. Lemongrass. <laughs> Definitely you got oil. Bali. Good. Indonesia. The milk? Oh, chopped up coconut. Oh. Some yeah, bits, the soup now. Some crunchy things, some crispy things. <laughs> There's a lot going on. That's just in this one dish. An all you need flavor on one single little plate. Ooh, Ooh. spicy. Oh man, that's incredible. That's really, really If it's not spicy, you know, in Thailand, it will definitely be spicy. Like coating the inside of your mouth, but it's so flavorful. All those shallots in there. Wow. I thought it couldn't fill your stomach, but looking like it, you can really fill up your stomach. You don't need any seasonings or any extra anything. It's complete. The lawar is complete. It has all the flavors you need all in one single dish. Wow. I have to make sure you have clean hands when you're eating these. 20,000 IBR for 148? Jeez. Oh, I 
Wow, 148. One dollar and 48 cents US is equal to 20,000. <laughs> wow! 20,000. The, 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 the notes in this area, in Indonesia. I'm quite sure the smallest note is like 10,000. They have to be. This one is a little further away, so I think it's not quite as popularly visited. If this meal is 20,000, what? The, it's it's small, it's so cheap as you. 35,000. Wow. So, a basic salary in Indonesia, then. Let's just say if you're making like. Reach to the sky and like 500 US dollars. And so tall. That means you almost like me have like millions. Yeah, you have like millions, no? Millions, whatever currency, IBR, IDR. Shrines and then all the, the stone sculptures, which are just they they start to wow. become part of peaceful the looking area. Monkeys, 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 monkeys. Ooh, ooh. Monkeys! And we got a kid there, if it's not kid, a baby. Aww. Uh, and sometimes monkeys can be a little overly aggressive and mischievous. Very much so. They seem pretty friendly. They just wanna take your stuff from you. Oh, yeah, I've got a drone! Wow, that's nice. He included a drone in his travel. To, it's literally just on the back side of the monkey forest where we just were. And this is a, it's a legendary place for Santa. Wow. What is what it is and in Bali Sate Babi, which is pork, pork. is very common oh, pork. for sake. And what I love about That's a lot of pork. The, the grilling in Indonesia is that they keep the coal so incredibly hot. And you can see here he has actually an electric blower which is <laughs> directly to the coals. And so that keeps the fire literally hot. red hot. Red hot coals the entire time that it's grilling. And that is really wow. Oh, oh God, this is a good test. He just went it up in there. Extremely smoky. Wow. And just have the the full fire flavor embedded into them. Oh, it comes with a satay soup. Okay. Wow. Thank you. Our satay has arrived. Say hello to our driver. <laughs> hey. 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 Awesome, awesome, awesome. I like him. Hey. hey. Nobody's like that, but hey. And they put it onto a little plate, and then they cool. add. Submerge it in, wow. and then the whole set it comes with rice as well. And the rice is wrapped up in paper, uh, in pieces of paper, and then it also comes with the a rice is wrapped up, mata, which is a mix of torch ginger flour, their chilies in it, and shallots, I believe, and then also with a soup. Look at this gigantic coconut, <laughs> but not only, not only what? The coconut is, but look, look at the size of that. Coconut. Look how much water that is. So maybe wow. She's just a massive coconut. And it look it cool and refreshing. Oh my gosh, I would love to taste a coconut right now. All our coconut most not all, most of our coconut trees have been destroyed by Hurricane Maria. So you know we're not gonna get that for a while. Wow. <laughs> Wow. And then that's a very smooth peanut sauce. It's a little bit on the sweet side, but that does taste extremely the good. Food is like a paper like a paper kind of material. <laughs> Delicious isn't it? Awesome. You really taste the torch ginger flower in there is fantastic. Wow. You can taste the lemongrass in there. You can taste the garlic and chilies in there as well. Garlic and chilies and lemongrass. I think a lot of people just lift the lift the bowl to the mouth. Wow, this is like a very down to earth setting. Everyone is down sitting with their leg cross, of course, on this special mat. I'm quite sure you have to wash your feet or something before you get in there. Wow. Nice. So that is a messy, messy, messy looking delicious um, sauce. With the sambal. sambal, that's with the rice. Yeah, the sambal is just extraordinary. And it's like everything he eats amazes you. It's like nothing is like, oh, I've tasted something like that before. It's like everything. Yes, but boiled, right? Yes. I oh, this one. 
Yeah. Yeah. And it's called Doom. There's some Doom. Meat and then mixed with all sorts of herbs and, and chili paste. Wow. And then they are uh, usually we have something like that, but it's with um, cornmeal. It's made out this of cornmeal. Pigskin. Pig skin. Ah, nothing goes to waste, does it? And pig blood, I think. Oh, my gosh. Like black pudding. You can really taste the lemongrass in there. What's, what's with the lemongrass? Is lemongrass like a, a, a like almost like onion or we have so onion used in the Caribbean and stuff like that cooking lemongrass is being used? You know it's a cool place That's like the second meal he's having. Random coconuts lying around. <laughs> these are the, these are the table stations. You can grab a table here. They have little snacks too. They have, I think this is fried pork skin. They have little packets of jackfruit that you can eat. Jackfruit. <laughs> All sorts of snacks, hmm. little snackers paradise, and oh, that was delicious. <laughs> Sink with a view into the rice paddies <laughs> in the forest. It doesn't get better than I that. know, right? <laughs> wow, that's... Okay, so 84,005 plus 6, 84,000. Six dollars, uh, not much, really, you know, East really cool US. So big thank you to Techie for this recommendation. Wow. We're now driving back to Ubud. And we are now stopping at Goa Gaja, which is the elephant temple, and this is a, a very Goa ancient Gaja. temple F and cave, and it's a very popular place to visit in Bali. For two adults, please. It's 15, 15 thousand. For adult. <laughs> Fifteen thousand. Wow. This has been there so long. It's really an entire Clearly. temple complex, and they have various shrines around, including an incredible huge tree right in the center. But the most famous uh, part of this temple is the Elephant Cave. Elephant which Cave. Back to the 9th century, and the rock carvings, wow. which, is, uh, which protrudes right out of the, the cliff face. I love how the rocks in Bali and the sculptures just start to decay. <laughs> yeah. And it's like so you can see if they're very, very long. To, they start to go back into the jungle wow it's very dark and damp and you can really smell the incense wow it's like an adventure and eating at the same time but well, this is amazing food and travel attraction it's really dark in there not bad at all I like the so fact that it's so, so tropical looking. And we are now on our way to go eat again. Eat again. My food, my food, my food. The next restaurant we're going to is called Warung Makan Teges. Uh, Nasi Teges. No, Makan Teges. Nasi complete two. Makan, Makan, Makan. Lovely food of Indonesia. Is it called Nasi? Nasi ayam, or nasi champur, nasi champur, okay. Yo. Mini mix. So they have a front wow. area where yeah, and they're using paper, so that's actually good. Because, you know, like, person, some person still using styrofoam, and, you know, this don't decompose. So it's like, I'm quite sure this paper that they're using, it can decompose later. It will burn easy, it's, I'm quite sure it's somehow made out of tree, of course. So, it's a good choice, I mean... They should consider this using this sort of plate, so it's like the paper instead of the styrofoam. You can also bury this very plate, this paper plate. I mean, if you want to, if you have a lot, you can just bury it. It will just become part of the earth. But the styrofoam plates, they are, they refuse to decompose. <laughs> they're in the sea, they are all over the place. They're in the rivers. Crunchy things. There's some soft things. There's half, <laughs> half of a hard-boiled egg. There are some green beans, and then the sambal in sambal. particular here, which is the, the chili sauce. Oh mix. wow, it's chili! Unbelievable. He likes to eat chili, chili food. Mm. <laughs> oh, all that shredded chicken is awesome. Wow. Oh, you can put some chilies in there. And that potato, or oh, that green grass. thing. Eh? Is it the potato and or Christopher? Looks like Christopher. <laughs> I'm telling you, everything he eats is like, it's amazing, it's new, and that's actually good, I mean, it gives you the, the desire to just come to this place and enjoy exactly what it is it's enjoying, what he's enjoying. Okay, what to try next? 
um, add some sambal there. I think I'll try for this. What's that? That's a piece of fried liver. Fried liver. If it's we'll nice. Sambal. So eating if your hand is a common thing, I suppose, in Bali, Indonesia. It's a common yeah, thing. Liver. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. It's a little dryish. That's sambal though. <laughs> Next for the satay lilit, which is a minced meat. And he knows everything. It's like, oh, oh yeah. How does he remember it? That's good too. It's a little bit sweet. One more thing I want to show you. At first I thought this was like a paste, but it's Looking actually like a, like a crunchy fritter. Looking like a chicken. Man, you break it. Deep fried little little fritter. Okay, that's gonna need some sambal. Uh, yeah, you could literally just eat a mountain of this sambal. Wow. It's so good. But it's chili. I don't like chili stuff. <laughs> and maybe it's the attack it away. Maybe a deep fried. Oh no, wait. That took a little while for the flavor to come, but that's actually coconut. You can taste the, the dry coconut in that. I think that's just dry like coconut. a little deep fried coconut patty. Okay, mm. time for the ribs next. <laughs> that's a lot of meat. I think the ribs have been deep fried there, nice and crispy on the edges, uh -huh. and then nice and salty as well. Sambo, sambo. And outside pipe again. Very nice. In Bali, you'll just eat meal after meal of <laughs> What does IDR mean? $2.21 cents US. Most likely it's US. But IDR. Oh, so satisfied right now. Big thank you very to nice Box setting. For everyone for recommending this place. I must admit, very nice setting. Do they have things like ice cream in... in, in I'm only seeing a lot of, I love every single request for the food, but I, I wouldn't mind seeing like a dessert kind of food tour, sweets, candies, um, ice creams, cakes, and all the area in the settings is like very tropical, tropical green and cool and quiet. Within the courtyard, it's so relaxing, such a, such a prime dining environment. Very. Indonesia, Indonesia. I'm seeing the half boiled egg for sure. Which is cooked in lots of spices, and then it comes half with a, egg. There's a long bean what is that? Salad. There is a satay. There are some crunchy bits. There's some peanuts on there. A half a hard boiled egg, all surrounded by rice. Similar to the one he just ate, it seems. Well. The plate is beautiful. It's just, it's and clearly, it's, it's in the hand is common, of course. Of ingredients and different dishes surrounded by rice. Wow. <laughs> oh. Normally, you see, like, if you're eating with your hand, it most likely it has to be something like in my country, dashing fig yam, like some people will eat with their hand, like, but not rice. We had, I have never seen actually. Sir, feather on that skin, that's how you know it's delicious. Really, <laughs> there's a feather in there, that's how you know it's delicious. In my country, if there's a feather on anything, the person is freaking out, even demanded it be returned. Feather is not something that we promote in food. And then, yeah, I think that's a little piece of intestine. That chicken, though, is stunning. A piece of intestine, what intestine? Do? I was a pig's a pork. But it's not dry at all. What I like about a mix like this is that and the egg. Watch the half boiled egg. What is it? What was it boiled in? It's much different. I mean, all eggs, all when you boil it, the yolk is yellow, but the outer part of it is white. What is it called? <laughs> Samba. And wham! Eat it out. Traveling to eat. Wow, I love the fact that they always they always have something with water falling that into was something. Another winner of a meal. And this again is somebody's family it's a family compound and so they have wow. a little village set up. You, you just get off the street where the street 25, is twenty five thousand IDR. Or dollar eighty four US for plates. Wow. Okay, of, a a place to relax and wow. eat. Okay, of all the food we ate, I think my favorite thing that we ate today was the Lawar Sapi. That was an incredible dish, that breakfast dish that we ate, and then doing some sightseeing around Sunday. Yeah, and rice fields. It was, it was 
It's a great video, of course, out in Indonesia. Indonesia, amazing food and travel attraction in India. Mark Wayne, of course, doing this video. Of course, thank you very much for requesting this video. Don't forget, guys, of course, subscribe to Mark YouTube channel. Subscribe to Mark YouTube channel. YouTube channel. Subscribe to my channel, of course. Like his videos and follow them. Thank you very much. Definitely do. Thank you, Mark, for this awesome video. I am definitely subscribed. Subscribe to Mark and myself. Goodbye from Bali and I'll see you on the next video. Thanks again for Great watching. Mark, take care. Thank you very much for requesting this video. Of course, guys, subscribe to Juno's with just a commentary. Like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter. If you want me to react to the video, definitely leave a comment below and I'll try my best to react to it. Thank you very much. Bye guys.